Hi ladies and gentlemen, welcome to IT Snippets. Today I'm going to show you how to take an image downloaded and put it on our SD card for a Raspberry Pi. First things first, we're going to need the program required, so open up your browser. In my case, this is Opera. Go to www.soundforge.net slash projects slash Win32 Disk Imager and download Win32 Disk Imager. I already have it installed, but you would just install this like any other Windows application. Once it's installed, Go down to your start bar, go down to I for image writer, which is where it installs, and open it up. User account control will kick in and ask you if you're sure about this. So obviously we did click on it, so we are, so click on yes. Just give that a moment to open up. Okay, now that it's opened. What we need to do is in here, we need to click the little folder and point this to the image file that we have. Now I'm presuming at this point you've already downloaded an image file for the Raspberry Pi. In this case, I have Open Source Media Center, so I'm just going to click on that. So I'm just browsing to where I downloaded it. So as you can see, this is my downloads folder and then click open. Now regarding choosing a device, I have two USB devices connected. One is drive I, which is a USB hard drive and drive F, is my SD card. Now, most laptops these days have SD cards actually built into them. If you don't, you can pick up SD card readers for about a pound in Poundland, or possibly a few pounds more on Amazon. They're not very difficult to get a hold of. So once you've done that, you would simply click write, and that would write this image onto this SD card, or this USB drive. So please make sure that this is the correct drive. I'll just show you that drive F is in fact my removable drive and you can always check it by clicking on this PC and checking the size of it, although that's not correct because this is actually a 32 gig drive. Anyway, you can tell that it's obviously not the hard drive that's 500 gigabyte is what I'm basically saying here. So we would simply click write. Writing to a physical device can corrupt the device. Target is drive F. Are you sure you wish to continue? Well, that's kind of the pointless, so yes. This shouldn't really take too long to do this. Okay, as you can see that says it is complete and the rate has been successful. So we can click OK, and then we can exit out of that application. If we go down to our taskbar down here and onto our USB devices, we can right click that and we can safely eject drive F, which is in this case, my SD card. Now that that has been safely ejected, I can take that and place it in my Raspberry Pi. If you like this video, give us a like. If you dislike this video, give us a dislike too. If you get feedback in this or any other videos or suggestions for videos you believe we should do in the future, then please let us know in the comments below. But most of all, thank you for watching.